Let me tell you about a client that uh, I helped about a year ago who had a roofing business. He was in, uh, he owed the IRS about $215,000, if I recall, uh, but he was retirement age. He was in his late 60s and not in good health, but he had substantial equity in his home. Um, so when you file an offer and compromise with the IRS, they look at three basic components. The first thing they look at is how much time is left on the 10-year collection statute. And if I recall, he had five or six years left, so uh, we had to convince the IRS on the other two components. The second component was his net asset value, and he had a substantial equity in his home, uh, more than what he owed, I believe. And then lastly, his net income. His net income was fair, uh, but we ended up uh, opting for what's called exceptional circumstances. Because of his bad health, we were able to convince the IRS that even though he had the ability to full pay around $215,000, we negotiated a debt at $93,000. I could have pushed harder and maybe lowered his tax debt, but he felt responsible to pay his fair share of taxes. But when all was said and done, we reduced his tax debt by more than $120,000. It took about six or eight months. My client did still pay a substantial amount of money, but he was very happy because his, his uh, idea of what was right uh, was complied with. He paid a substantial amount of money, but saved him $120,000 because of his bad health, his age, and we qualified for exceptional circumstances.